Hey guys, welcome back, welcome back to our channel. In case if you are new to this channel, means please subscribe to our channel. Well, now in this video, I am going to share you how to remap keyboard keys in your Windows 10 or Windows 11 based PC or laptop. So I am using the Windows 11 Pro Edition in my PC. So now to remap the keys in your keyboard, so you have to install one application which is called the Power Toys. So Power Toys is one of the best application, and that application is from Microsoft side. So it is a Microsoft Power Toys application. Just to go to the Microsoft Store and search for the Power Toys, and here is the application Microsoft Power Toys. Just to install it in your PC or laptop, and once you installed, so now this is the application. So once you get this application, now here at the left side, so lot of different features has been here. So Power Toys is one of the best application for your PC. So whether you are using a Windows 11, 10, or 8, anything, so it is one of the best utility tool you have to use. So because in this application, there is a lot of of different features that will be really helpful for you on a real-time usage so in this power toys application you will find the uh, option called keyboard manager just uh, click on that so once you click on you have to enable that just uh, turn on this uh, enable keyboard manager and after that you will have a uh, two option one is a keys and then a shortcut the keys is for to remap a key for example in your keyboard if any specific key is not working like that means so in that condition you can able to remap a different key for that key so for example i'll show you so i'm just to click on the remap key so in the physical key so you have to add which key you want to going to remap so you have to add that key for example so in your keyboard if uh, a key is not working like that means so during that condition you can able to convert the other key to do a function of a a key so for that you have to just click on the plus option so in the keyboard we are not always using all the keys so just to use the key which you are not using often so so for example for this i am using the f6 key so just to click on the type and after that i am going to click on the f6 and just to click on the ok so now in our example a key is not working in the keyboard so i am type the physical key as f6 because the f6 is not frequently used and after that in the mapped to option so just to click on the type and here you want to press the a key and that's it just to click on the ok option and after that at the top click on the ok now in case if you can't able to to type that the particular key the a key so your uh, particular key is actually so fully not working like that means so in that condition you can use the on-screen keyboard so just to go to the search bar and type for the OSK and uh, just to click on the on-screen keyboard so now the on-screen keyboard has been came so just to click on the type and here you can uh, just to type the a option as you seen here now the a key has been pressed so and after that just to click on the ok and minimize the on-screen keyboard and after that just to click on the ok option and click on the continue anyway now so i am just opening the sticky note so in the sticky note so we have actually remapped the f6 key to the a key so in our example a key is the not working in our keyboard so whenever if i'm actually pressing the f6 key so the a is actually typing if i'm actually pressing the shift plus f6 so capital a has been came so like that you can able to remap a key in case in your keyboard if a specific key is having a problem like that means so if you want to continue your work urgently like that means so you can immediately use this feature to remap your key and you can continue your work without any issue so this is a remapping a key and then next option is that remapping a shortcut by default in windows we have a lot of shortcuts so we are going to remap the shortcut now so to remap the shortcut you have to click on the remap a shortcut option and here you want to uh, given the physical shortcut so for which shortcut you have to remap so you have to give that shortcut for example so in this case we are going to use the windows plus d shortcut once you press the windows plus d it actually goes to the desktop mode so we are going to remap the windows plus d shortcut so just to click on the physical shortcut just to click on that plus icon and after that click on the type and press the windows plus d and click on the ok so now for the windows plus d shortcut so we are going to to remap to the windows plus yes windows plus yes is for a search so we are remapped the windows plus d shortcut to the windows plus yes shortcut and after that just click on
click on the ok option now whenever if i'm actually pressing the windows plus d it actually opens the search uh, ui like that you can easily able to remap a shortcut and also the default windows plus yes is also actually open the search ui only well now in this method you can able to remap a key or shortcut in your keyboard so in the windows 11 or windows 10 based pc or laptop so you can able to do all these things using the power toys tool so it's a microsoft based application and it's a free of cost only well now that's it on this video guys and hopefully if you guys like this video hit the like button and if you are new to this channel means please subscribe to our channel below and thanks for watching this video guys